हरे कृष्णा इफ एन आइडियल इंस्पायर्स मोर रिग्रेट देन रिफॉर्म एंड अ मोर अटेनेबल इंटरमीडिएट आइडियल इज रिक्वायर्ड वी ऑल लिव इन अ कॉन्स्टेंट टेंशन बिटवीन द रियल और द एक्चुअल एंड द आइडियल वॉट वी वॉन्ट टू बी एंड वॉट वी आर ना दिस टेंशन हैज टू बी एट अ ऑप्टिमल लेवल सो दैट वी आर इंस्पायर्ड टू राइज सिंपल एग्जाम्पल वुड बी सपोज समबडी इज एट अ जिम ना इफ ऑल द वेट्स आर सो हैवी दैट द पर्सन कांट इवन मूव दम देन दैट पर्सन मे बी वीक एंड अनफिट but seeing such heavy weights may just make that person discouraged and feel i can never become so strong as to lift these weights and then they may just go away and not even try to improve a little bit so if the weights don't inspire people to exercise then what is required lighter weights so then those lighter weights everybody whenever they are trying to do something they need a taste of success or at least a realistic hope of success and without that they will soon lose lose motivation and give up so this what applies with uh, physical weight lifting also applies with we could say inner weight lifting we all have certain ideals that we aspire for and aspiring for those ideals means that we are trying to lift the weight of our conditionings and push it away from us and that requires energy it requires effort and it's sometimes very difficult so uh, if an ideal makes us more regret just makes us feel with with regret oh i can't do this i can't do this i can't do this and then it makes us feel i can't do this so better i'll stop trying to do this also then it it inspire regret is required to some extent but the regret should lead to reform if there if there's no reform and only regret then eventually the nobody likes to feel bad constantly and then in order to stop feeling bad uh, we start numbing and dumping the voice of our conscience and we give up aspiring for the ideal we silence the voice within us which tells us that we should rise up and if that happens then there is stagnation and there can be degradation also so then what is required an intermediate ideal just like a lower weight is required which people can lift then people need if a particular they can't follow a particular standard then they need to be given a standard that they can follow so that they can rise up this is the mood of uh, inclusion and compassion that the bhagavad gita demonstrates in 326 where it states na buddhi bhedam janayet agyanam karma sanginam joshayet sarva karmani vitvan yuktah samacharan so na buddhi bhedam janayet that don't disturb the minds of people even if they are ignorant and attached agyanam karma sanginam then what should you do joshayet sarva karmani joshayet should engage people in their according to the way they can work channel their work so that they can gradually be elevated vidwan yukta samacharan in appropriate actions that means what krishna is telling uh, that if we are give telling people some ideals and if it just agitates and disheartens them then we need to give them one step up a um, intermediate ideal and that we can apply to ourselves also and thus when we give people give ourselves and others attainable ideals then we can take the steps attain that ideal and from that intermediate ideal we can move up eventually to the higher ideal also thank you hare krishna